Hello guys, welcome to our series of tutorials on EZB. So this is going to be our second tutorial. Today we are learning how to use labels. So this bar right here on the top is label bar and you can create labels here. So let's say I run a I run a, a yoga coaching a yoga teaching class and I have batches in the morning at 7 a.m at 8 a.m at 6 a.m i want to segregate my all the students into different tabs so i can i can see i can send them messages uh, according to the timing according to uh, different things that are required so what i'll do is uh, i'll first this uh, latest table that i already have so right so now we're going to create create a new label and in this label we'll set 7 am as its name and we can also choose a color here we'll choose yellow and then save so now we have one label as 7 am and we can create more labels like this like 8 am so for my 8 am students now what i'll do is uh, uh what i can also do is if i'm changing the time uh, of my morning classes to say from 7 to 7 30 I can just come here and change it from 7 to 7 30 now also if I have students that uh, are enrolled from for different different uh, type of classes suppose one is learning pranayam and someone else is uh, learning some some different yoga um, let's say Willow, Willow. We can set this sub label also. So now, when we come to 7:30, we get these two labels here that says Pranayam and Willow Willow. What we'll also learn is how to add contacts to these labels. So if I come to 8 a.m. and click on this drop down and click on Add Contacts to Label, what I can do is I can select contacts from here so if i contact select this and this these are my students i can also upload from an excel file and so let's say i have these students as my um, <coughs> uh, in my atm class so i'll just save it and voila uh, i'll see these uh, students uh, students chats here now i can uh, send them messages keep a tab on them how they are performing and everything that i want to do so this is how you can create tables you can also delete a label you can come to edit and just delete that whole label and uh, it will be deleted so this is the tutorial for today keep watching this channel for more such tutorials we will be back